never going back for the Ask the Empowerment series. This is Ryan Mack being brought to you by the ARP Foundation, the Michigan My Savings Jar, the savings club that we all want you to join in collaboration with the one and only Detroit City Councilwoman Janae Ayers, Detroit Task Force. This is a series that is specifically designed to make sure that every week we can bring those individuals who are returning citizens some good empowerment information to make sure that they can get reintegrated back into society with great financial empowerment tips on a regular basis. I want to give a special shout out to Janae Ayers because the work that she's doing through the Detroit Task Force and bring all these organizations like the ARP Foundation and other organizations that are all committed to making sure that those individuals who are coming home from prison are loved, are appreciated, are supported, and they just want to pour into them. And so without further ado, I want to give the first tip. I just want you to write down the word faith. Faith. F-A-I-T-H. Faith is one of the most empowerment, the greatest financial empowerment principles that you could ever use. You, can't, you don't have anything if you don't have faith. And there's a mathematical equation that I want you to memorize when it comes to faith. You're coming home from prison. I need for you to have faith. And here's how we break down faith. Faith is one half belief and one half acting on that belief. One half belief and one half acting on that belief. Listen, for you to have faith, we want you to believe. We want you to believe that your former will be greater than your latter. We want you to believe that you are bigger than all the obstacles that you're going to be facing. We want you to believe that there are some things inside of you that the world hadn't seen yet that you want to get out that we're going to be blessed because you found out. We want you to believe that God has a purpose for you and you're going to walk on to that purpose. We want you to believe that there is a difference between success and greatness. Success is what you do for yourself, but greatness is what you do for other people. And when you find out what God has put here for you, you're going to be great. And we want you to believe that greatness lies within inside of you. I'm excited that you're going to believe it. But Believing in and of itself is not enough, my brothers and sisters. Believing just in and of itself is not enough. We've got to act on it. And that's we want to help you with that action. The action, especially when it comes to finances. Because at the end of the day, when you're living out God's purpose for yourself, when you're living out what God has put you here to do, sometimes the, the worry of money gets in the way. We don't want that to be an inhibitor to making sure you can achieve the full purpose of God because there's a lot of folks that are waiting on you to bless them. So we want you to help with, we want to help you with that action plan of helping to repair your credit, helping to put together a good budget, helping to make sure that you can navigate through financial predators, helping to get you to become a homeowner, helping to make sure you can start that business, helping to make sure you can give back to your community and be a philanthropist, helping to make sure that you can pay down your debt, helping to make sure you have the right financial mindset and any other thing that involves a great action plan, we want to assist you with that so you can have the belief and the action and the faith. And we have faith in you. The ARP Foundation has faith in you. Janae Ayers, Detroit City Councilwoman, Janae Ayers and her task force, they all have faith in you. But all that means nothing if you don't have faith in yourself. If we want to help you with that walk. If you want to help us, allow us to help you with this walk. This program is free of charge. You will never be asked to pay a dollar for any services. This is not some undercover solicitation for us to uh, sell you some insurance or get you to sign up for a credit card. This is not that at all. This is all free of charge. And all you have to do to get access to me is email me. Just that simple. Any question about anything from credit to investments to savings to insurance to estate planning to anything. I've written a few books about this stuff. I know a little bit about it. Email me and I want to answer your question. No question is too small or there's no such thing as a dumb question at Michigan at MySavingsJar.org. Again, that's Michigan at MySavingsJar.org. And we want you to sign up to be a part of the Michigan Savings Club. It is tremendous. It is awesome. It has great tools and bells and whistles for you to, to learn the habits of, of budgeting and saving and setting goals for yourself. And it helps you to track your goals and make sure you're getting on track for your goals. It's, it's a free digital service. Go to mysavingsjar.org slash Michigan and sign up for that. And of course, we want you to get involved with the Detroit Task Force. Man, this task force formed by Detroit City Councilwoman Janae Harris. Proud to you, Janae Harris, for doing such tremendous work. She's pulled together a group of organizations that are helping individuals get jobs, get training, to have uh, counseling services, uh, financial services, not just myself, organizations like United Way and Goodwill. These organizations
organizations are all pulled together to help you get back on your feet financially. And boy, I got to tell you, it's a tremendous amount of wealth of resources and networking opportunities. And hey, you might be a returning citizen. You can definitely come out to the meeting. Check out the description below with all the information in it. And you can find out where and the schedule when the meetings are coming up. And also, if you're an organization, man, look, Detroit City Councilwoman uh, Janae Harris is always looking for more organizations that want to join her task force at the Detroit Task Force. So come on out and, and participate if you have a heart like we do to give back for those individuals who are returning citizens. And hey, if you don't go to the meetings, you're not a returning citizen, hey, we want you to share this information because hey, you know, you know, you know somebody who's been in prison. If you don't know, somebody in your network definitely has. So share this video. We want to get this empowerment on the road. We're excited for this Never Going Back series. Thank you for your support. We'll see you on these weekly tips. Peace.